we are taking firm steps towards our 2023 and future goals by combining the strengths we derive from our glorious history and the energy of our children with today's dynamism, Erdogan said. He also commemorated the founder of Turkey, Mustafa Kemal Atatürk, and all the martyrs of the country in his message. Turkey every year commemorates the first gathering of the Grand National Assembly of Turkey, which took place in 1920 through ceremonies and visiting Anatoly Atatürk's mausoleum in the capital, Ankara. Due to the coronavirus pandemic, the Turkish nation will celebrate the National Sovereignty and Children's Day and its 101st anniversary of the Parliament's foundation from homes under a nationwide curfew. We Prime Minister Turner has to meet so happy. On Thursday, said there will be a meeting with the Turkish President as they need to communicate. There will be a meeting with Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan, but I am not in a position to... This is the... Um Voice of Turkey, received on the ATS-20, a.k.a. the SI-4732 Chinese-made receiver, uh, 9830 kilohertz at uh, 2200 UTC. So uh, this is using the MLA-30. Now, this is a strong signal in general. The window's very noisy here. I wonder if I use the telescopic if there's something that's going to pop up. Uh, receiver. So, actually not that bad considering that I'm in the, my office. It's kind of receiving it a little bit. Not very strong, but if I should, you know, try this and maybe my kitchen, I think I would actually receive it. So with the telescopic, it actually seems to work somehow. And of course, we'll be testing that outside. We'll be using it in a park. We'll be using it in a field. We'll it probably will be part of one of my uh, Perry Island the expeditions. So this is going to be interesting to test out. Intriguing little device, I gotta say. Uh, of course, no verdict yet. We're gonna continue using it. There's gonna be a review of this, of course. So, 9830 kilohertz, voice of Turkey. Uh, this Chinese made receiver. Using the uh, silicon integrated chip. The European Commission had also noted that the EU countries had agreed by 2030 to reduce the greenhouse gas emissions to 55% below the 1990 level. Climate action is also a massive opportunity for economies to create new markets. 